Hey guys, I want to talk to you a little bit today about those times in your life when you just get overwhelmed and you have this overbearing volume of things that you need to get done. You've just got this monumental task list ahead of you and you're just, you, you almost don't know where to start and you become consumed. And of course you get stressed out by this. Of course you get, you, you your emotions become stirred, of course, when you have these these phases in your life where you feel so overwhelmed with everything that you've got to do. And I just want to share with you a little small, small piece of advice that I have this talk with a lot of my friends. For some reason, people have always loved to, to come to me for advice and we just talk about life stuff. And that's, by the way, part of the, the impetus of the, the channel here, if you've ever wondered about that if, or if you've been listening long enough or to catch that little nugget there. But Beside the point, the, the thing that I wanted to tell you is that there's a very good friend in my life that has a much more complex life, let's say, than, than mine. He's got a lot more moving pieces going on. He's he just got a lot of elements at work. And that, that's a sharp contrast to my life, which is actually quite simple. And I that is an intentional thing. I, I really try to keep my life simple and try to not accumulate things to worry about and accumulate too many complexities because I just know that's that's something that, that makes me happy and keeps me on an even keel. But anyways, we'll always talk about these things. I mean, he'll have these weeks where he is just just buried with life stuff from you know his work life to his family life to all sorts of responsibilities that he's taken on above and beyond those things. And, and the guy is just, he's, he's honestly, he's a very good person, but he's, he's oftentimes very overwhelmed. And the, the point that I'm trying to make here, just the, the piece of advice that I want to share with you guys is that when you have those times in your life where you're so overwhelmed, what you have to do is you have to break things down into chunks. And what I'm always telling him is say, you know, okay, he'll he'll go through his whole week about all these things he's got to get done. And I'm saying, okay, like, I get that. You've got a really busy week ahead of you. But like, let's just talk about, okay, just in the next 24 hours, like what are the absolute things out of all those things you just told me that need to get done? So take it in 24 hour chunks and just try to prioritize those things in your mind and just take take that bite, take those chunks, think about literally the next 24 hours in your life and like what of that list, like I said, you have to do. And all those other things that, yes, they're still going to be there. Yes, they're still going to be addressed, but they will come after that next 24-hour period has elapsed. So just don't even worry about them. Don't think about them. Yes, they're still there. You're going to get to them. But just all you got to do is concentrate on this next 24 hour chunk. Tell me what you have to do. Okay. And we'll talk through that. And oftentimes like you'll still be overwhelmed. So I'm saying, okay, if 24 hours is too much, then give me 12 hour chunks. What is it in the very next 12 hours that you need to do? Take that chunk. And if that's too much, give me a six hour chunk. And if that's too much, a three hour chunk. And if that's too much, just tell me like what you've got to do in the next hour of your life. Now, granted, that's a pretty rare thing when somebody is so busy, but it's just the reason why I flowed through that whole sort of sequence of, of those hour breakdowns is just to just to illustrate the point, just to give you an idea of what I mean here is just you have to break things down into chunks. You have to think about it on those terms. You have to kind of develop this ability to to, of course, keep yourself organized. But not only that, you have to prioritize your tasks in, in just along those lines of, of having a discussion with somebody like that. It, it forces them to think about, OK, of all these things in the list, like what are the most important things I need to address right away? And what are the things that can wait till later in the week, for example? And so you just have this natural way of, of putting things in a queue, putting things in a, in a hierarchy, let's say. And I've always found that just to be personally a very orderly way to, to go through life when you have these, these times where you're just overwhelmed is to, to go through that mental process of breaking everything out into chunks. Therefore, you're, you're doing the prioritization and it allows you to keep things just you can tackle them in, in smaller bites. It's it's kind of like that same sort of thing where, you know, there's a, a figure of speech, which I always thought was kind of funny, but if you were trying to eat an elephant, right, as silly as that sounds, how would you do it, right? Well, you take one bite out of the elephant at a time. This is pretty much the exact same message I'm talking about here. It's the same thing. It's just, I used the word chunks before, and that's quite literally what I mean, but this is just the same thing. Take a small bite out of life. What do you need to consume and chew in that next bite, right? Don't worry about, you know, you're up here eating the <laughs> the head, let's say, of the elephant, and like you're worried about the ass end, right? You're not even there chewing it yet, so don't worry about it. It's the same thing in your life. It's the same thing. You got tasks. When you got overwhelming situations. When you got a volume of things to do, it's the same exact thing. Just, just concentrate. Like I said, just break it down into 24-hour chunks. Do what you got to do. 
this will help you. It's, it's helped me. It helps my buddy. <laughs> I know this is something that's not always easy to keep at the forefront of your mind when you are becoming overwhelmed in life. But if that's your case, hey, hopefully you can come back and listen to this recording at any point in time during your life when, when you might need to hear this message or you want, might want to be reminded of this or you might want to have a little, a little push to, to get you to do something like this. So, All right, guys, that's all I have for you today. I hope you're having a wonderful day out there. We'll talk to you real soon.